Doors for entrusting us with the sale of their home. We at Beacon and Scott consider it a privilege to be acting on their behalf. Now, for those of you who are involved here today, quite frankly, exciting times. Of course, the most excited will be the eventual purchaser of this fantastic property that stands behind me. And in the next 10 minutes or so, the decision on who that buyer will be will be entirely up for you to decide, not myself. Now, if you are planning on bidding here today and you're a little bit nervous about the entire process, just relax. It's my job to make sure that each and every single person here today has a fair and equal opportunity to secure this home. Now, the contracts, they have been on display for the last half an hour or so. There is nothing untoward in there, but there are a few details that you, as a prudent buyer, should be made very well aware of. The property is legally described in the Certificate of Title as volume 10328, with a folio of 793. Better known to you and I as Unit 8 at 37 Monco Street in Baronia. The terms in which our vendors are calling for here today, ladies and gents, boys and girls, is a deposit equaling either 5 or 10% of the purchase price and the balance in either 30 or 60 days from today's date. A shorter settlement would be preferable given that the property is currently vacant. Now the auction will be conducted in accordance with any rules and conditions that were made available prior to the start of the auction. The vendors, they do have a reserve price. As the auctioneer, I'll indicate bids upon request. The law prohibits false bids, it prohibits any disruptions by bidders, and it does provide fines for this conduct. The words I'll use if I'm going to make a bid on behalf of the vendor are vendor bid, and by law, only I as the auctioneer can make a vendor bid. Now, the rare chance of the property being passed in here today, ladies and gents, the highest bidder at that point in time reserves the first exclusive right to negotiate directly with the vendor. That's an important one. So I'll just repeat that. On the rare chance of the property being passed in, the highest bidder at that point in time reserves exclusivity to negotiate directly with the vendor. So if you are interested in this property here today, I need to see your hand or your paddle up in the air. Now, I don't intend to walk you through the property room by room. That's what we've had the open for inspections for over the past four weeks. And as I look around today, I see a number of familiar faces that have been through the property over the past four weeks. Better yet, let's start with where the true value lies and let's begin with the address. Monco Street in Baronia. We are literally walking distance to schools, shops, transport, essentially everything that Baronia has to offer. The property has character, it's cute. It's got charm. A good functional floor plan, good size rear yard, good size bedrooms. So whether you're buying as a principal place of residence or buying as an investment, a property like this in this location, you cannot go wrong. When I call it first, second, third and final call, and the contracts, they hit my hands like so. Be rest assured, ladies and gents, boys and girls, the property will be sold. So, now the fun part, hopefully before the rain starts. Without further ado, I'll turn it over to you for hopefully your spirited bidding. And we'll find out who the lucky new owner of 8 at 37 Monco Street in Baronia is. Stop me where you will. A fair and reasonable opening bid Makes no difference to me where we start at. Once again, hopefully before it starts raining. <laughs> Got all day. Two forty. Three forty. And and welcome to the bidding search. Take the brave soul to open up the bidding, and we'll take a bid there at three hundred forty thousand. Make it nice and simple. We'll call it 10 on the rise from here. That $340,000 now, calling for three fifty dollars anywhere at all, should be a Mexican wave of hands going up at that price point. That aside, we are at $340,000. I've got clear instructions to properties to be sold. 
First call at 340,000. At 350, welcome back now. At 350, 360, if you'd like. At 350, we are fairly bid. Clear instructions. Three and a half. First call at 350,000. Second call might be your lucky day. At 355. I'll take 10 if you'd like. I welcome you back to 360. Second call at 350. Third and final call. We all silent. We all done. At 350, clear instructions. First, second, third and final. Be sure. Bargain buying at that level. I'll give you a couple of moments to have a chat. Might be one bit, you've got it done. I welcome you back at 360 if you'd like. Okay, I'll call it three times. First call, 360 if you'd like. Second call at 350,000. Third and final call, sir, at 350, call for 360. Extremely good buying at that level. <laughs> okay, if it makes it easier, I'll take the five. Is the five still there? Yeah. At three hundred fifty-five thousand dollars, I welcome you back. At, at three hundred sixty, we'll straight back at you now. At three hundred sixty, three hundred sixty-five, if you'd like. We got there in the end anyway. At three hundred sixty thousand dollars now, we are fairly bid and offered. At three hundred sixty-five, if you'd like on the nod. At three hundred sixty thousand dollars now, we are on a first. We are on a second. We are on a third and final call. We all silent. We all done. At this point in time, just to keep things moving along, I'm going to put in a vendor bid at three hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars. I welcome you back at three eighty-five, and I won't bid against you again. At three hundred seventy-five thousand dollars, I welcome you back at three eighty-five, and I won't bid against you again. Have a chat. But you've got my word there. I won't put another vendor bit over the top of you. Extraordinarily good buying at that level. Thank you for your patience, everybody. It's a big decision. Just to make sure they're making the right one. I can assure you they are, as long as they increase. <laughs> I won't bid against you again. Point for 385. We are now on a vendor bid at 375. Point for 385. That will be my final. Clear instructions, the property is here to be sold at public option. Thank you for passing that, Mike. Okay, I'm going to call it three times. If there's no further advance, I'm going to pass the property in on a vendor bid. So then nobody reserves the first exclusive right to negotiate directly with the vendor. First call at 375,000. Second call at 375,000. Third and final call. Do 385. So close. Okay, I'll take the 380. Ladies and gents, I'm just going to seek instructions. Just bear with me for a second.
Okay, thank you for your patience, everybody. I'm now announcing we are on the market at 380,000. So if there is no further advance, this person, this buyer, this couple right here will secure the property at that price point. So no further advance, the property will be sold under the hammer. So first call at 300 might be your lucky day. At 380,000. Second call at 300. And 80,000, no late bids. Third and final call, we all silence, we all done, no further advance. First, second, third and final, we are selling. You sure? Phone call, no. We are selling. We are. Sold! Congratulations! Commiserations to our underbidder. Thank you all for attending another successful Biggin and Scott auction. We hope you have a wonderful weekend. Thank you.